This is Danny Gould with the Selling Silicon Valley Group. Welcome everyone to another South San Jose two minute drill where we go over all things real estate related in two minutes or less for the month of March here in 2020. We're super high tech here everyone so we'll go ahead and start our timer in three, two, one, getting it. So. South San Jose is behaving a little bit differently than, than other parts of Santa Clara County in the sense that there still are more homes sold, both in the condo and townhome sector and single family sector, as opposed to for sale, which is going to put pressure, upward pressure on prices. If you see below in the single family sector, we had 20 homes sold and 26 homes uh, listed for sale. And uh, sorry, 26 homes sold and 20 homes listed for sale. And in the condo and townhome sector, we had 17 homes sold and 13 for sale. So not too much of a difference, but still impactful enough because when you look at the single family sector, at the number of, uh, or the sales price to list price ratio, we're at 108%. And that has been steadily climbing over the last few months. What that means is that if you're a single family uh, owner in South San Jose, either Santa Teresa, Blossom Valley, underpricing the home and driving it up through multiple offers is working. There's a lot of competition there because of the suppressed inventory coupled with demand. You also look at the days on market, 10 days, super, super low. And so this concept of, of underpricing multiple offers, driving the price up is working and it's working very, very well in South San Jose. Now, when you contrast that with the condos and townhomes, things are a little bit more stabilized, they're neutral. And so this, uh, the sales price, the list price is right at 100%. The average days on market is 46, which means that if you're thinking about selling your home in the South San Jose area and you have a condo or a townhome, you should be pricing your home right where you want it to land and expect to be on the market for a little bit over a month. And that's just the time it takes for the home to marinate. It doesn't mean that you're going to uh, you know, sacrifice price per se by, by pricing it where you want it. What it simply means is that the market is taking time to absorb and, and really you know, uh, take into account your property before someone makes an offer. And so finding that perfect buyer is gonna take a little bit of time if you're a condo or town homeowner is South San Jose. That's all the time we have folks, but if you want more uh, content when it comes to uh, South San Jose or, or, or the Silicon Valley marketplace in general, you can go ahead and subscribe to the channel and subscribe to the Silicon Valley Snapshot where we cover all things real estate related in Silicon Valley and keep you up to date every single week. If you have questions about your particular situation you can reach out down to me uh, you can reach out to me at the contact information wow down below this is Danny Gould everyone with the selling Silicon Valley group and I will catch all of you in the next video